hey guys welcome back so today we are going to do a video on how I pineapple my hair at night for my nighttime routine so I start off just by pulling my hair all the way up to the top of my head and I just pull my hair out outward and upward and once you have your hair pretty much all the way to the top of your head you're going to just take a scrunchie um, actually this is a headband an elastic headband I'm just going to place it around my neck and pull my hair upward and you don't want to make this pineapple tight you can use like a really really loose uh, scrunchie but you do not want to make your pineapple tight I'm going to take a satin um, scarf I got this from my local beauty supply store and I'm going to just take that and put it in a triangle and I'm going to place that around my head so just watch and see and then I just tie it at the top of my head um, I don't tie it tight because I don't want to get a headache. I've tied it too tight before, so just tie it. And then um, you are going to take a black satin bonnet. If you have a satin pillowcase, you can stop here, but I don't sleep in one. So I want to make sure that all of my curls are covered in satin so they can stay uh, nice and moisturized. And I'm sorry, guys, my camera was focusing on my curls instead of my face, but it'll get better in this frame. So this is the next morning, and um, after I do my makeup, I usually take off my scarf and my cap after I do my Tupac look. <laughs> but I usually take off my um, scarf and my um, satin bonnet and then I remove my elastic. I just kind of give my hair a shake like so. So at this point I pretty much just shake my hair to try to give it um, its shape back and then I kind of fluff it and then I just leave it like that and I don't touch my hair for about five to ten minutes. Oh, I gotta do the head shake first. <laughs> then I wait five to ten minutes. I usually go get dressed and then I come back to do my hair and I always go in with my purple pick as you guys know and I'm going to just pick my head out. Pick my hair out so it can be nice and full because I love big hair so and I also like the pineapple method because it also stretches my hair in the back so my curls in the back are a little bit longer on day two and three of a wash and go so that's another reason why I like to pineapple and I'm so happy my hair is finally long enough to be able to pineapple it so after you do that you just go in with some edge control to lay down your edges as always I do this every day because I do get makeup on my edges some days so I have to go in with some gel or cream or something to lay them down Okay guys, and that's pretty much it. This is the finished look. This is my hair on, I believe, day three of a wash and go. Um, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.